All right, Fuzz Pie Guy here, back again with another video. Now, what you're looking at here is a little breakout board for a uh, computer power supply, something like such. Just your typical power supply. It could be a full modular or, or not, it doesn't matter, because all we need is this connector here, the 24 pin. Now what we do is we plug that into here and this can split out to three volts, five volts, and 12 volts. And we got some normally closed and commons. And as you can see, the different options that this has. Here's what the, backs, the back looks like. So what we'll do is, we'll go ahead and plug this in. I'll throw a link in the description for the, uh, where to get this online. I just picked it up off of Amazon. So it's clicked in. Let's plug it in. All right, so the power supply is plugged in and we have power, as you can see, the red LED light is on. Now the power supply is powered on, but to turn the power supply on to feed this, all we need to do is click this little power button here. And as you can see, the fan turned on. The green LED is on. And if we just get our meter out, we can check some things out here. So we got three volts there. Not getting a too good of a connection here on top of the screw because it's not screwed down. Very good. And we got five volts there. And let's go to 12 volts. And we have another 12. And we have the more threes. Then to turn it off, we can just hit the power button there. Power supply powers down. No power coming out of here. And we can verify that. Voltage is slowly dropping and if we power it back on there we go so this would work come in handy pretty good for like a raspberry pi any type of pi that you want to power off with five volts maybe you got an external fan that's uh, 12 volt and if you want to power some uh, maybe some esps off of three volts So, thought I would just share this little quick video here of what this thing can do and what this looks like. I believe that I'm going to be using this with a power supply. Maybe I'll get a little less interference off the cheaper power supplies. And we'll go from there. Alright, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another one.